Hey guys, it's GBD from GBassGamer.com and the CAGCast video game podcast. And I just got this email and I'm sure a lot, everyone else got it too. It's the E3 Summit Attendee Survey where they're going to take our feedback and see what the story is for E3 next year. Now, it's very important that there's an E3 next year, no matter what shape or form it is, uh, at least as far as I'm concerned, because it's really my only chance to get out of the house and speak English to people and have fun. So when we fill out this survey, we really got to make sure that it, that there is an E3 next year. It's very important to me. So let's take the survey. Oh, that's not it. Here it is. Okay. So let's fill this out together. Uh, on a scale of one to five, how efficient? Oh, it's incredibly efficient. Couldn't be any more efficient. I got my business done. How valuable is it to me overall? Very valuable for reasons I just explained. Otherwise, I'm staring at the wall all day and just talking to my internet friends when I could be at E3 talking to real people and smoking weed in the back of ta LA taxi cabs. It's very important. How likely am I to attend the summit again next year? Please have one. I need to be there. Thank you. Um, were the people that I needed to interact with at the summit? Yes, I already mentioned the taxi driver. It's very important that he shows up next year. Do you believe the summit fills a unique niche for an entertainment industry event? Oh, yes. Well, actually, there are other events that fill the same needs, but uh, I'm not invited to them. So we're going to choose this answer. Do I feel the summit event hours was too long, too short, or just right? I'm going to say too short because even though the show ended at like 6 o'clock, I think the show should go till midnight. That way there's a good chance of me passing out drunk on the show floor at around 11 o'clock. All right. Let's see what the next page has. Of the following options, which month would you most likely see the summit? All right. So July is a little too hot. I'm going to go for May. I like May, it's a little, a little cooler, it's very nice. Uh, most appropriate duration for the summit, as long as humanly possible to get me out of the house. Uh, with regards to hotels, which is more important, to, uh, proximity, definitely. Um, I don't mind paying for a nice hotel because I'm a C-list internet celebrity and I need to, I need to relax, quite frankly have a nice spot. Did I visit the Showcase Pavilion? Yes, it was very sad. Um, so we can skip this one. How useful did I find it? It uh, was, I would say it was pretty useful, I guess. If you didn't have an appointment for a specific uh, publisher, then that's where you could check out the games. And there was nobody there, so there was really no, was no lines or anything. Did I attend any of the press conferences at the convention center? No, because they're a waste of time. Uh, if you didn't, it's not, I'm not interested. Okay. This, I didn't even take any of the shuttles, I don't think. So I'm going to say, don't ride the shuttles. We're well, okay. Oh, I did take one to the, to one of the press conferences, but I don't even know if that counts. We're just going to say no. Email. We're going to choose email over regular mail because I live in Japan and they, you know, it takes forever to get the regular mail because, uh, I don't know. They're very slow. Summit website was easy to navigate. I don't know. You know what? Let's give. Let's throw them a bone there. We'll say it was enough, too much, or too little information communications from the summit. I'll say too little. You can never have too much information. Oh, and that's the end of the survey already. Wow. Well, that wasn't very exciting. Let's go back to YouPorn. See what they got here. No, I'm just kidding. Don't look at that, folks. Well. Thank you very much for joining us for the E3 attendee survey. And it was a good test for me to try out this uh, screen flow. Is that what this is called? Screen flow? Screen flow, screencasting stuff, something I may want to get into in the future. We will see you next time on CheapAssGamer.com and the CADCast.